If I get four more people, then I can get some, uh, I can start making bread. So I'm trying to figure out how to get these. Like, there's really no... There we go. I was like, what's it? Get rid of that. No way of knowing how to... Do that. Hmm. Maximum pending immigrants sixteen. Current pending is zero. I thought maybe building up a bunch of jobs, which I do have available, would bring in more people, but I didn't do what I thought it would do. So maybe. Hmm. I don't know. I'm kind of lost right now. <laughs> I'm like super lost right now. It's been like there was really no indication of what to bring people in. Like they were just coming in. Everyone was just filling up these houses like crazy and now they stopped. I mean, they're happy over here. Sixty percent happiness, and they're happy over here too. I mean, these guys are not so happy. There's a lot of them—they're being taxed. Kind of stuck. <laughs> I'm legitly kind of stuck right now. Like I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to build to make that happen right now. I don't know how to bring people in. Let's see what happens when I upgrade a house. Okay, upgrading the house just adds more people, or just increases the amount of people you can have, which makes sense. Doesn't increase the taxes, but just increases the amount of people. Okay, that makes sense. I could have just went through and upgraded all these houses. Well, that makes that's pretty good then. We can go through and upgrade all these houses and we'll get a bunch of people here. Maybe it's just the um Maybe it's poor boy lands. <laughs> Bringing the, <laughs> the factor down, and no one wants to do anything. Here, let's just boost this up. We'll make the happiness go up. Maybe it won't be down so much. You know, it's poor boy's land that just likes to, um, you know, like they like to party all the time. They want a rowdy, rowdy crowd that lives over there. All right, Damon, you have a good night, man. Thanks for hanging out. <clears throat> hmm. 
do, do, do. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We got it now. Yep. Okay. So the happiness has to be at probably a certain percentage. Ha 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 ha. We're bracking up now. Figured it out. So. Here are this. Now we got people rolling in. Thirty-six people now. Okay, nice. Let's get all our houses filled up real quick. Make sure everything gets up and running here before I start going on a mass spree of upgrading and building more. We want people in all these houses first. That's a fifty-three percent, sixty-seven. But now. We can start making bread. Oh wait, we gotta unlock it. Unlock. Now we got bakery and windmill. Windmill able to turn grain into the finest flour. Cool. All right, so we have a bunch of grain here so my guess is they're gonna take it from there to, to the granary so we'll put it right smack damn next to the warehouse because that makes sense there in the sense that they'll just pull it from here go from there back and forth boom 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 we can put another farm up here too and fill this in so we can get a bunch of that that's really where we should put the uh, bakery at now. I'm gonna put it, where's that bakery? The bakery's a little small little thing, so let's keep it. Oh, whoa, 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 I hit the wrong button. It's tiny, let's put it right there. <laughs> keep it all right there in the center there. Maybe build another one too. That way it's kind of just We'll circle through like bam, 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 bam. So not too far where they have to go too far because if I mean if it makes sense, like the grain and the wheat's gonna be here, or the the grain, everything's there. So they're gonna mill it down and then it's gonna be wheeled over there. So if I had a bakery like way over here, it's gonna have a courier, it's gonna go have to travel. So this should be efficient in the sense of we should get a bunch of bread coming in. Unlock by cake. Oh, you can make cakes too. Nice. So you can set up each one to do certain things. Cakes and bread. So we need... How much bread are we making here? We need room... Oh, now we're going to be using water. I mean flour. Which is right here. We're making flour. Three flour every 35 days. I'm getting, a, I'm getting a kick out of this. This is actually pretty fun. It's kind of a, like a little bit of a learning curve here, but it's not too bad. Now we got a bunch of people coming in. Almost there. We need 12 more people. Then we can get our tavern and we can start going on ex explorations. How are we doing on our houses? Two, 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 two. That's all filled up. Filled up, nice, there we go. That did it. Okay, so we just have a, we have to have our percentage at 60% to bring people in, okay. So, yeah, because I was at 40% and nothing was happening. Even went up to 50, not much. Well, as soon as they hit 60%, they, they're rolling in. So let's start upgrading these things. Yeah, that filled up quick. All right, so I need eight more. So let's just do two more. This is going to be our high-end area right here. Okay. 
keep the poor boys laying just like that. We'll build up the, uh, what, I don't even know what that is. What is it, Westgate? Yeah. Yeah, we'll, we'll get them all nice and fancy over there. Some fancy orcs. Cool, cool. Yeah, all right, this is going pretty quick, actually. 30 flower, 35. Supported carriers is eight, and we got available is four. Okay. Available. So we're we're pretty good now. So we're actually about three to two zero. So it's not too bad. They're getting the jobs done. Nothing's really waiting. So far now. Like, yeah, they're pretty much right on it as soon as it opens up. So done, done. Okay, that's done, done, done. So nothing's really sitting. So that's pretty good. I guess we got to keep an eye on that. And make sure if anything's like pending for a while, we got to make sure that I'm sure that's not the case. And they're kind of doing the same thing. We got three of them here too. They're really, I don't know what they're grabbing to be honest. Stone and grain is going there. Out of berries, let's get some berries going. Might as well get those going. Ah, oh, we need four more people. How do I do that? Oh, I forget. I was counting four per house. It's only two per extra per house. We need to upgrade this one and that one. I was thinking it gave me an additional four people. I was like, wait, what? We're at 73% 73, 73 happiness now. We got 60 people. We can build a tavern now. Oh, yeah. Uh, knock. Yeah, I really want to check out what this explora exploration thing. How big is this thing? Ooh. Can I stick it here? No. Oh, that's a bummer. That would be nice right there. I mean, I would, could if I get rid of the roads. But then they won't have a place to get out. So no, I can't. I can't even stick it there. Well, I can stick it. Oh no, that. Yeah, I can. I really want it right here. Yeah, yeah. Where's the entrance? Right there. Oh, those orbs are stuck. Don't worry, I'm getting it. I'm getting it. Cool, we got a tavern now. Well, soon. Are we doing good on money? Oh, whoa, we're losing money now. Uh-oh. Well, no, never mind, never mind. I built a bunch of stuff. Okay, I was like, geez. The maintenance is 79. Okay, we're making money still. I was like, dang, we're gonna lose almost 130. Forgot I built a bunch of stuff. How are we doing here? Everyone have bread yet? They got bread. So that's what boosts up everybody's happiness. Oak 2. Orc 2. Huh. Yeah, I feel like you're gonna probably eventually have to build. What's that ring? I didn't notice that ring before. What is that? Oh, that's the coverage. Oh, the cut. Okay, nice. So the market area will cover. Oh, dang. Okay, the market will cover all of that. They cover all that. And the house, I don't know what that really does, but 
Just kind of shows all the rings, really, I think. Oh, nice. There we go. We got a tavern now. All right. Recruit a party. What? Okay. This is cool. What is this? <sighs> Higher cost is 50. The adventure is one you definitely... This adventure is one you definitely need to keep on your side. They're masters at repairing weapons and armor in a pinch, but also have a distant ability to calm down an argument. Oh, see what they got. This character possesses extraordinary luck. This character has long fought in arenas across Talam. Dwarven heritage. This character is proud of its rich race, rich and noble heritage. Cool. And they have a level? An XP? Trade? Oh, come on now. That seems pretty neat. What's these guys gonna do? We gotta get, let's see. I guess we should probably stick with a... This dude looks like a vampire. There we go. Orwin Grill. You have... This character isn't afraid to deal their problems head on with a big hammer. This character is extraordinary unfazed by even the most dire of situations this character is proud of his race okay let's get this person what do you have this character is able to uncover anything this one's a fighter let's get this one higher and we can get multiple people let's get two of them how many people can we have? What's the party size? All right, return the map. Let's see what happens. Oh, so that's the party. Oh, what do you mean getting excited over a party? <laughs> Edit party, so we can add more. So I'm thinking, what you can have four probably to a party. <clears throat> Uh, send on an Avenger, competition, idol, ex all right, let's see, neutral, AP1, let's do an adventure. Unseen Society, is that their party? Monthly upkeep is six, send on an adventure. You go this way, and what did that do? That's it? Oh. Exploring. Cool. What'd that do? So they found me more of this stuff. Whoa, wait, I can build over here now. How, I, how can I build over here? What did I do to get that? Oh, nice. Okay, so they unlocked that. So they got iron and coal over there. And that's only stone. What's this? Marble. What we got? We got a bunch of quests done, didn't we? Um, yeah, we got this one done. So let's unlock that. Uh, this here, we got this one done. Citizen tier, firefighter station, and citizen. Citizens who provide more tanks and have more specific needs. Okay, let's see. What do they need? They have different needs such as basic clothing, beer, cider, and whiskey. They're going to need all this new stuff, huh? Well, I'm going to have to unlock it to unlock all that. There we go. The fruit farming... Animal farming. Oh boy, now we're getting into the nitty gritty of things. So a brewery, we need to start making barley to make beer, and then same thing with whiskey. 
We just need 30 citizens now. So we need citizens. Mid Destiny Citizen House. Two. Don't I have that? School. So we need 15 citizens, required residents of 70. Technology or no, a large, oh, a larger warehouse. Okay, iron smelter, cool. So, I guess I don't even know where I want to start. We need definitely more people now, and then coal to make tools. What do we need for fruit farming? Just stone, and in animal farming, we need stone. Which we're kind of already working on. Alright, we need some dwarven encampment. Oh, see, we need a dwarven encampment to do that. So how do we get that? Orcus encampment we have. So we can start making whiskey. We need some citizens. And more people. So we just basically need more people. I think that's a good start there. To get more citizens. Ten more residents. And we can start making animal farm and a weaver. I think that'll be the next step. Congratulations on reaching the citizen tier. Watch out though, you might find fire will start spreading. Be sure to build a fire fire station. Oh boy. Fires now. All right, can we get rid of all this? Yeah. So I guess I'll build a, wait. We can't do barley yet. In order to do barley. How do we do barley? We gotta unlock more of this. We need citizens. And how do we get a citizen? Oh. Oh. We can upgrade the citizen right here. Oh, dang. Yeah, I knew it. We are gonna start racking up some more money now. So they no longer want berries. <laughs> they want eggs. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna bring in money now. So, okay, yeah, that's what I figured. I figured it's, it's, it's gonna start bringing a lot of money in real quick. They want eggs now. So that gave us f all four, so they're all citizens. We needed what? We needed what? How do I get eggs? Alright, so we need. Well, we just need residents for this, really. And then 30 there. Okay, so now I know how to do that. We'll probably just hold off on that um, for now. Because I don't know if I want to get too crazy with citizens just yet. Because um, I feel like if I start going in on a massive spree of a bunch of citizens, they're going to get real picky. On the fact of... Uh, on the needs. So we'll just hold on that and then start upgrading some of these places here like so. Uh yeah, we're going to start needing start upgrading some of our things here. We got to get this upgraded here. Can we do upgrades? Yeah. Uh 50 wood, 80. So we're going to start boosting up our wood cutting cuz now we're going to start needing it real quick. 
I'm pretty glad I was able. I kind of sat and, and let it kind of ride up and get stockpile. Because we have a, quite a bit so for now. 645. We got some. We're gonna need to build up a lot more stuff. Oh no, our stone's over here. Ooh, not a lot. I wish there was like a resource tab though. We need a resource tab somewhere here so I know exactly how much resources I have instead of looking at these warehouses. I need to bring this up. Let's that focus okay there we go six more six more residents and I can build more houses that'd be the easier thing to do and the cheaper for resource wise because if it's uh 30 percent and 10 wood which as to upgrade one it's 25 five stone it's five stone it's kind of I mean I don't spend money and I make money so the better thing to do is probably just upgrade it I mean, I'm just using stone right now I didn't find any more stone things did I let's see we need to do more explorations keep clicking on that thing. I need, uh, what do I do right here? So, oh, there isn't any? Oh, here we go. So I wonder what happened here. So like what? They got one action point, party action point. Can I like, they're level twos now? The character is so charming they could charm a brick apparently. <laughs> cool. He got some. This character has his extraordinary ability to see in the dark. Man, too bad you can actually like play as him. That'd be cool. Let's go over. Hmm. Can't really tell what's over there really until they look at it. So we're kind of over there. So I say we send them on an adventure over here. I really don't know how this unlocked. That's kind of interesting. Unless I'm curious, like if they unlock this, does it unlock an adjacent one? Kind of waiting here to see what happens. No, didn't. So I don't know how this unlocked. That just unlocked like on its own. Look at my town. That's pretty cool. That didn't give me any resources over there. It did. It gave me stone. Which is a good thing, actually. We can use that. Let's see. Um, are we bringing in 97 on our maintenance costs? We're bringing in citizen taxes, <laughs> peasant taxes. Um. 127, so we're making 18, okay. So let's get more stone. It's eight. Which will we'll make ten gold. 
Well, maybe I thought I thought I would make be maybe making a little bit more than I. I thought we'd be making a little bit more money. I know, I know, I gotta get a road. There's animals right there. Alright, let's build this kind of going like that. That. There's little deers here. Can we, like, are you able to hunt these deers? I think we should upgrade that. We're gonna need that. Because now we're gonna have a couple there. That will bring us in more stone. I guess that's why they don't really have a tooltip, because they kind of show you right there what you have 164 and then it costs five. <clears throat> but it still would be good to have one, so you can just know. All right, so we can, we're at 94% happiness, nice. Is this a, I think I'm, now that we got new stone production coming in, I'm gonna upgrade these. There we go, we'll just upgrade all those. Use a good shot. We got a bunch of grain over here. How we doing? We make we got uh, 80 loaves of bread. There we go. Bam! We got 70 residents. Perfect. Now we can upgrade this animal farming. Cool. Now we can do weaver and animal farm, providing all the animal products you need. Which then gets into this. Now we need citizens. Then there's the eggs, chicken, and beef. So now we can build some farms, get some chickens going, so we can make some chicken meat, eggs, and some cows, or the beef. We need eight more, though. Nine more people. Yeah, look at this. This is actually growing pretty quick. Oh man, look at that. He's taking so long to get over there. <laughs> now I see why there is the stockpile within the actual place. We can hold up to a hundred, so this one's gonna probably rack up quite a bit. I wonder how much the carriers can carry at a time. There we go. So now we'll get zero percent of this stone. Wait, when, with the efficiency of zero percent, the stone will mine will produce four stone every zero days. <laughs> what? Why? There you go. Okay, now it's now it's working. I was like, what? What happened? So four, and that's still four. So we get eight now. So this one will rack up a little bit here. It's gonna accumulate some more. Um, and then hopefully they, I don't know how much they can carry at one time, but we'll find out soon.
cool i think this is a pretty good start now i think this is gonna be a good stopping point for now this is actually pretty fun i'm actually enjoying this i'm enjoying a lot of this so we'll go ahead and call it here and we'll pick up on it again and continue growing our town and get our citizens up and running wait a minute i want to check something real quick what did happen with the party how do i look at the party Are they level three now? So they're level three now. So I guess they just get these little perks and buffs. Which is cool. They level up pretty fast. The XP one, trade points one. Uh, he got what, mana? This character is skilled with the physical objects with mana. Okay. Knowledge of written languages of other creatures. So that's pretty neat. I don't know how much of this will really Maybe helps them, or they're just like little, like, you know, little goofy things. Like, I don't know what it really adds to the benefit of them. They do have different ones, as you can see down here. But I don't know how much of a benefit that is, but. Seems kind of cool. You just keep exploring. That's how you unlock the maps, but. Yeah, so we'll go ahead. Oh yeah, look at my little mine out there. <laughs> Call it there. How do I save this thing? There we go. Cool. All right. Yeah, we'll go ahead and end there. This is um uh distant kingdoms. Hey, Chan was it Cams? Hey, Cams, how you doing? I don't know when you dropped in, but yeah, hope you had a good time hanging out, man. Um, yeah, I'm, I'll pop in here and do a couple more i'll stream this for a little while see how far i can go like two minutes ago oh man just well unfortunately i'm leaving and you've got the last two minutes so i hope it's good but hey you know just join me next time i'll be playing this again if you want to check it out a little bit more um this is distant kingdoms and it's fun so i'll talk to you all later peace